So we're at Old House today. We're going to check out what we're doing here today. We're here to record two songs, and it's going to be nothing but goodness. Mainly because I'm here, because Chris Gorges is here. Not because David Centendry is here. Dan, I don't know what Dan does, but... So, Dan's using the Yamaha Recording Customs today. This is a far cry from the Ludwigs that we've used on the rest of the album, but they're terrific sounding drums. But he is using the old Keystone Badge Ludwig snare, which is always attractive. What are these? KM 184s? KM 184 Neumann overheads? Um, Audio Technica M450s? ATM 450s? Some kind of weird AK AKG thing on the hi hats? I don't know. This is. This is Chris Garge's deal. I I don't get to worry about any of that stuff today. You see, we have just a little assortment of microphones over here. We have an U87 just kind of sitting out, chilling, old 414, you know, telefunk and the stuff. I mean, no deal. This is David's stuff, and we don't really care about David's stuff. I don't know who that is. This is, this is where the magic... You get over here. This is where the magic happens. Right here. This is like what, if I was a guitar player, this would be what would be called number one. But, looks like hell, sounds like heaven, is my first piano. Complete with the cigarette burn that somebody else did, because I don't smoke cigarettes, because I don't want to die. And, uh, yeah, it's a pretty great piano. And it's going to sound really good today. We're using the small stone phaser down here with our little BB Sonic Stomp. I change it up from time to time. Depends on what sound I'm going for. But for this, for tracking, just in particular, I'll use a small stone. We may pull a Leslie out later and use this with a Leslie. Stay tuned. We're going to come in here and say hi to Chris. Hold on one second. Well, room. we do have, yeah, I mean, we do have some goodies here. We have an old Ace Tone organ. This is the Leslie. Uh, I think it's a Hammond C of some sort. I forget now. It's been a while. And uh, that will also get used a lot later today. It's the Honor Clavinet, which is just complete. Oh, it's just great, and I want it. But Chris I has it. I want it. I want it. I want it bad. Say hi, Chris. Hey! <laughs> and there's Dan. Hey! For good measure. Damn it, we gotta edit Dan out of that video. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, no good tracking session happens without a few things. Okay? One is chicken filet. Um, Dave drinks Gatorade. There's Sour Patch Kids here. Also, a few other things. Come back in here for a second. These are things that make for good recording sessions. Well, let's look over here. Lava lamps. I don't know whether this was a 1990s fad that I wasn't old enough to be a part of, but apparently every studio that I've been in, that I've done work in and done good work, there's always at least one lava lamp. Chris has an assortment of lava lamps. He's really into that kind of thing. But, you know, it is true. You know, the lava lamps bring good swag. <laughs> and last but not least, diet soda. Now, diet soda, folks, if I drink about 10 of these today, I guarantee this will be, this, this session will be, there's a word for it I'm not going to use. On tape. Uh, now, <laughs> why Diet Coke over Diet Pepsi? Well, Did you fail the Pepsi challenge? Well, a few things happened. One, this is what was in the refrigerator out there. Um, I, This is actually what I had at the house this morning, too. So, you know, I'm just trying to keep it in unity. Um, but 
it's not Coke Zero, but it does have, I don't know if we can get in there, it does have 46 milligrams of caffeine per 12 ounces. So that's important. So, you know, and it has zero calories per can. So if I drink about 10 of these today, I'll make it through. I'll still be kicking about 11 o'clock tonight, 12 o'clock, you know, when we're winding down and everybody else has hit the wall but me. Because uh, I'm doing me, regardless. Do you? I'm, I'm doing me. But... Yeah, so Diet Coke, Lava Lamps, Chicken Filet, Colby Dobbs, as long as I'm at a session, it's probably going to be decent. And uh, and Chris Garges, too. Chris. And there is a tape machine in there, a 24-track tape machine. That that helps, too, uh, just, you know, with the overall morale, uh, knowing there's an old tape machine around. So that's that's what we're doing today. We'll, uh, we'll get some more video later when it's important. Right now, there's nothing real important going on. Watch your step. Yep. Oh! So, we'll see you kiddos later.